What's up, Jay family? Back again. With some more reaction videos for y'all. Well, let me check something real quick. Yep, cool. <laughs> I'm back. Um, it's been a long, long, long time coming. And a uh, quick update. I am not in Texas anymore. Just to, just to, I'm in DePaul. Uh, I am in Chicago. I have moved to Chicago for to complete my master's um, in film and television with also doing my final year of track and field. So I have really been moving around a lot the past couple, I think month. Yeah, really month or months, no months. So that's why I have not been posting. I finally got adjusted to the new space and I got kind of the equipment I needed to do videos again. Um, and honestly, more than needed equipment. Um, so I'm very blessed to like, you know, be able to bring y'all updated and kind of a different look on the videos. Hopefully this camera quality is really nice. Um, hope y'all enjoy it. I really can't wait to edit it and put this together and see it. Um, but yeah, that's where I have been. Um, so I'm in Shy Town, and finally get to come back. Well, finally got time to do this. Hopefully, I'm gonna try to be consistent. I'm gonna do this. Let's. I'm gonna do three videos. This day is be. This should be up tomorrow. So Monday. Today Sunday. Um, hopefully, I'm consistent. I have so far a little busy schedule, so I'm gonna try to fit in videos. If it's not three, it might be one or two. Um, but I'm gonna try to be consistent. I also have one more channel that I will be posting on just as much as this one. And that's gonna be my, my film, my film and TV slash one where I'm gonna put in all the, the videos I take, all the short films I create, all the work I do, I'm gonna post it on that one. And I really am looking forward to, um, to really putting out more for that channel just because I'm doing a lot already. So it's, I feel it's gonna be make content or whatever I, you know, opportunities I get, I'm gonna put them out. And if y'all like to see these films, the commercials, like anything in the film, TV, camera work, all of that, yeah, that could, that's gonna be the channel for you. I'm gonna put that also in the description um, so you can go check that out. But yeah, that's kind of where I'm at right now. So I am very happy to be back and to give y'all more videos. This is, <laughs> so without that, without further ado, we're back with a pentatonics rabbit hole, and I have really been out of it for a minute. So this one I just saw today. This is just the audio. This is prayers for this world. Um, came out. I think I said two weeks ago. September. No, three weeks. It came out three weeks ago. Um, wow. The fact that it's already October is already almost finished. It's crazy. Um, yeah, this is Pentatonix Praise for This World, official audio. And since this is the most recent one I saw, I kind of wanted to do, react to it. Definitely if they put a video out. So that'd be cool. Um, but you know, it'd be cool to listen to some audio. So let's get into the video, y'all. Let's go. These are hard times in these times Feels like the world's about to capsize Feels like it might take a miracle To make it out alive The clock is ticking What do we do? Is someone listening? First off, I like this already Oh shoot, why well, I just, I just thought I, I just figured that's a What the heck? Holidays around the world. Dang, are they already starting on their holiday stuff? I didn't realize that's an ornament. <laughs> that's cool though. Um, I kind of like how they have Africa right there. That's cool. Um, are they already doing like their Christmas stuff, holiday-ish type of things? New, new album. Woo! It is new album, Holidays Around the World, out October 28th. Wow, cool. Honestly, I'm looking forward to that. I'm actually looking forward to like the holiday season. Definitely in Chicago, how like the city, 
like the city life of like um the city life through the holidays. Ooh, I'm actually very excited for that. I like that. That sounds really good. Okay. That sounds really good. Oh, I love that harmony. Um, well, I like that. Because uh, I, I honestly, I feel like I haven't listened to like anything frequently of Pentatonix. All I listen to was kind of like their older stuff. So it feels kind of refreshing hearing like newer. I love hearing new music because it just kind of reminds me. Not reminds me. It lets me see where they are at now. And like, are they still on the same route as they used to be? So this is a really good like eye opener for me. That like, yeah, they are. You just wanna run it out. this drop because I'm gonna let it finish after this drops. Dang. Let it settle for a minute. Are right, you ready? Back. Let's do it. Oh! Peace with this world. Bring peace to its doors. Bring hope to its shores. We've got to change it. Hey. Praise for this world. I did not expect that. So refreshing. I'm like, oh my gosh. Okay, calm down. <laughs> Yo, I don't know why that just gave me like, one, it gave me a, a flashback of like that feeling when I first heard them during my holiday season um, at UNC. And the main reason I bring that up is because during that time, it was a tough period for me. And listening to them during that time period was like, you know, it gave me comfort, it gave me peace in the moment. The, the song itself just allowed me to like this, 
you know, music really doesn't just impact me in a way that gives me that feeling of refreshment, that feeling of peace, um, that feeling of like <sighs> taking in my situation and then, um, I don't know, like it just gives me, it just, it just helps me out so a lot. So that just brought me back to that point in life and now looking at where I'm at now in a better place, better situation. And like, I don't know what about this song just made me feel good. <laughs> I feel really good. Um, yeah, that felt good. I don't know, I can't even explain it. That, that felt really good. I don't know, sometimes like song, it's just, when it like reminds you of what you've been through, and what you went through, definitely it's the same band that was, that helped you during that situ that moment. And then you listen, or a group, and you listen to them again, and then you hear a song that basically resembles that song that you fell in love with when you first got introduced to them. And now you're just hearing them in the, like, it's, oh, it's like, it's kind of like, when I listen to music, it like, it's for, how to describe it. Sometimes songs help, like when I'm going through something, basically when I'm going through something and I am stuck to listen to like, if one song catches my, my, my really my heart touches my heart and it's like perfect for my situation, then I attach that song to my situation. So now every time I hear, um, which one was it? Um, Hallelujah. I go back to the situation when I was at UNC and going through what I was going through. And that song like just helped me cope with it. So now this song kind of resembled for some reason that Hallelujah. Um, and well, actually not, it didn't resemble Hallelujah. This song just really is now taking place for this situation of me just, you know, in a different, kind of like, oh, man, it's so hard to like explain it. <laughs> It's like now this song is, is one help me remember my past situation and allowing me to be, not allowing me, but helping me be thankful for my situation now. And from like getting from there to how to where I'm at now, being thankful, thanking God for it, thanking Jesus for it, for real. And then like just, I don't know, feeling that peace and that happiness that like, I don't know. It's really hard to explain this. I don't know what it was. It just felt really, that just felt good. Like I'm trying to explain it. I don't know how. And that deep, the deep title for me, Prayers for This World, like, I don't know. I don't know. I'm try, I, I really don't know how to explain it, y'all. I don't. Okay, I'll, I'll try, to, try, try it one more time. If I can't, then I'm just gonna. Leave it be. Um, I don't know what it. It made me feel good because it gave me that relief of where I used to be and where I'm at now, and the journey it took from there to now, and now like starting off with hurt, pain, struggle, suffering, to now prosperity, love blessings, peace, joy. It's like, it's like that journey that I'm going on and I'm taking them with me, taking their music with me. And now before, when I listened to them before, I was in a, a darker place. And now I'm listening to them. I'm in a, um, a better place, um, a place with light and love. I was at a place with light and love then, but just, it was this hard to see at times, but now I really can see it everywhere and I'm thankful for that. And now it's just like, wow, I get to hear y'all and that my situation is in a better place to where I'm not, I, right now I don't have to use y'all to cope. Now more of like I am, um, now y'all just reminding me what I've been, like what I've been through, what I, what God has helped me through, helped me get out of. And now where I'm at now, and I can be thankful of not only y'all's music for helping me, but where I'm at. 
And I think that that's basically why I felt so that this hit different. It just, you know, like, okay, I guess I'll, but that, that's kind of what I mean. Um, and I guess I'll ask y'all too, have you ever felt that, um, you know, when you listen to a band or a group, again, artist group, whatever, and at first you're in either, you can be in a good place too, either a good place or a bad place, and you listen to them, and they just connect on a different level with your, like, you connect with them, like, right? y'all like this, and you listen to all all the time. And then every time you listen to that song, you remember where you've been, or that situation you were in that made you connect to that song so deeply. And then go years later, you're listening to them again, different song or same song. Then you're at a different place in life. And for some reason, it just hits you deeper because it make it lets you remember or makes you remember um, where you used to be. So now it's like, wow, look at the transformation of my life and and where I'm at now. And then you just start thinking and being thankful or, yeah, either you can be thankful for where you're at now or be thankful for what you have before because your situation now could be worse. But it's be, um, but it just, it just takes you through something to where you remember your past and then you connect it to your future. Something like, like that. Um, I hope that makes sense. That's kind of where I'm at right now. <laughs> That's honestly what, what I felt with this. Um, Cause I really just went back to my, uh, to the holidays. Like, you know, this is a holiday song. See, and I'm still in it. Cause usually the holidays turned out to, like the holidays went from great to a moment of like whackness. You know, I love the holidays cause I get to go home and see my family, mainly his family. But then I was still in like tough situations um, or tough circumstances to where I couldn't really, sometimes couldn't really um, enjoy it as much. And I feel like I'm in a, again, a better situation to where I, I hopefully I can enjoy it a lot more. And the holidays are coming out very quickly. Um, and it, I don't know what it is, bro, but it's boiling inside me. I, like, I'm feeling good right now. Like, I'm feeling really good. I feel light. I feel light. I feel happy, joyful, peace. I know it's coming from God, too, because I'm telling you, it ain't no coincidence how pentatonics though like connecting with y'all and like putting that two and two together of like how i met them beforehand to now how i'm connecting with them now and literally i can't even lie i think it was around the same time too where i started listening or where i found pentatonics it was like creeping up to the christmas um um to christmas it might have been a little bit earlier maybe in the november but still it was creeping on to Christmas um, and the hol and like Christmas holiday. And honestly, it might it might have been before November, actually. I'm trying to remember. I, I know it was, I think it was actually before um, before November. I think it was leading up to Thanksgiving when I ran into Pentatonic. So it was funny how it's like in the connection again. And now I'm in like a whole nother place, a whole nother city, just like how I was then. Ah, crazy, comes full circle. Okay, that I uh, that might hit you different right now. Okay, I'm hoping I'm not sounding like jib I'm not speaking jibber jabber. Um, but yeah, this one hit different. I ain't gonna lie, this one hit different. That hit different. Um, let me know what y'all thought. That that really hit different for me. Um, damn, that hit different. Yeah. Dang. Yeah. I hope y'all understood kind of what I was, where I was saying and coming from. If y'all have your own experiences, it doesn't have to be with Pentatonix, but any other artist or or group, whatever, um, whatever, let me know, cause I don't know, that felt different. Like that hit, that touched, that touched my heart. Not even gonna lie, that touched my heart. Like in more than like a spiritual, that that touched my heart spiritually. It really did. Um, I love the song. I love prayers for this world. I love that. Um, definitely kind of where the world is headed. It's like, well, every every moment, every day, we need prayers because we're one, we are a fallen world, and you know, it's never going to get actual, it's never going to get the way we all hope it will be until Jesus comes back, and that's just facts and truth. So it's like, prayers for the world is the realest, realest um, thing ever because we continually need it. Um, 
I mess with Penn and Teller's because I feel like they, they just have an outlook on life and the world and their music reflects it in such a way that's like, I love it. Like, I love it a lot. Um, I love what they create. I love how they represent themselves. Um, I really appreciate their music a lot. So, it hit, it touched me. I know it touched y'all too. So, yeah. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> Let me know what y'all thought about this song. Um, let me know what other songs you want me to react to. Now I'm gonna go backwards, um, unless they keep putting out stuff. Hopefully this comes with a video. I would love to see the video. But if there's any other ones y'all want me to react to, cause I know there's a lot, let me know. And y'all, honestly, y'all have let me know. So honestly, I'm probably just gonna go back to the old comments and then go through those. Um, and yeah, that's how we gonna do it. But I'm out, J family. Happy to be back. And I'm happy that y'all are here. So, peace. One, no, not peace. One, subscribe for more content. Hit that thumbs up if you do like this video. Hit the bell. Be part of the post notification family. And I'm out. Peace. Love, blessings to you all, J family. Mwah. Stay.